A lot of you have been asking for my everyday makeup tutorial, so I'm gonna give it to you and I will try to be quick. For primer, I use the B Goldie Drops by Drunk Elephant. Blend with your hand. I lightly fill my brows with the NYX Cosmetics Brow Pencil. NYX Brow Glue to hold them in place. I use one and a half pumps of foundation all over my face. This is Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk. Blending with this huge Tarte foundation brush. I'm putting the NARS Creamy Concealer over my blemishes. This is where I put my concealer and I use the Makeup Forever HD Skin. Blending it out with this Hourglass Concealer Brush. Makeup by Mario Contour Stick. This is how I put it. It, blending it out using an angled tart brush going upwards on my face and then bringing it all the way down to my jawline. I blend out my nose contour with my finger, bringing it up to the start of my eyebrow. For blush, the Charlotte Tilbury Glowgasm wand like this, blending it up onto my temple and on my eye. Setting my face with the Givenchy Prism Libre Powder, bronzing a little bit with the Charlotte Tilbury Bronzer, Patrick Ta Blush and She's Giving. I hate to do this, but go to part two. This is part two of my everyday makeup routine. For fake freckles, I use this freck tint and then I blend it out with my finger. Put them on the bridge of my nose and then very lightly onto my cheeks. For highlight, I use this Film Star Bronze and Glow Palette from Charlotte Tilbury. Do a little here and a little on the bridge of my nose. And I'm gonna put it on my inner corners with my finger and also under the brow. I'm lining my lips with this MAC lip liner in the shade Whirl. Over top, I'm using the Burt's Bees Gloss and Glow Sticks. Lastly, I've put some eyeliner just in the corner of my bottom waterline. And that is how you end up looking Looking exactly like me. I feel like I did so much, but I kind of look the same. Expiration in five hours? Huh, I didn't know that drinks expire. You idiot, it's not when your drink expires. Well then, what is it? The expiration date is when your life expires. What? I'm a dog. Well, you don't have much of a choice. Are you okay? <laughs> no! What's wrong? I expire in three hours. Aw, I'm gonna miss you. Great, that helps a lot. Okay, listen, I know a guy that can help you. Really? Where do I find him? He's in a cloak behind the dumpsters. The password is spaghetti. Spaghetti, got it. Hi, I was wondering if you could help What's me- What's the password? Spaghetti. Oh, yeah. My expiration date is really soon and I don't want to die. I can fix it, but there might be side effects. What kind of side effects? A headache, diarrhea, I don't really know. I can handle that. Let's do it. If you say so. Hey, look at that. It actually worked this time. I should probably the apple is the apple. Uh, I've never heard that side effect before. <clears throat> headphones or sunglasses? What? I want headphones so I can listen to Olivia Rodrigo on full volume. They won't play any music? What the heck is the point of these stupid things? I hate being your friend and I wish that I never met you. What did you just say to me? Um, all I said was good morning. How are you? I swore you said something else. No, definitely not. I slept with your best friend. You're cheating on me? Baby, what? No, why would you say that? I knew you were a lying little piece of sh- It was only one time. No, we're done. Don't talk to me. Mary, I need you to say something to me. Um, like what? Anything. I really like the shirt you're wearing. Okay, now say it one more time. That shirt is hideous. This is my favorite shirt. What? But I said that I liked it. These headphones let me hear the truth. <gasps> Can you tell me if my boyfriend's cheating on me then? Girl, you literally saw him making out with someone else. But I love him. I smell your shoes while you're in gym. Ew, what is wrong with you? The scent of your feet is great. Hey, who's that girl over there? Oh, her? We call her Silent Beauty. She can't say anything. Why don't we go say hi? No, you cannot be seen with her. Whatever, guys. Hey, uh, my name's Ethan. I really like your hair. You remind me of the purple Teletubby. So, let me guess, you don't have any words. Uh, don't worry, I can speak for you then. Oh, hell no, you did not bring her over here. She is not sitting with us. Why not? She's cool. No, she's not. She's just a weirdo. Wait, whoa, 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 don't leave. I'll come sit with just you instead, not them. I just wish you could speak up for yourself. She's awful. You're the only person who's ever been nice to me. Whoa, what? You can speak? I thought you had zero words. No, I have infinite. What? You have infinite words? But everyone thinks you can't speak. I convinced everybody that I didn't have any words, but I do. But why won't you talk to anyone if you have words? Do you see how mean they are? I've been recording them. Recording them? What are you gonna do with it? Don't worry about it. How long have you been doing this? It started freshman year. I decided I was not gonna speak at all. And no one ever figured you out? Nope, they're kinda dumb. You can't tell anyone that I can actually speak, okay? I promise I am not going to. Do you want to help me expose them? Expose them like how? <laughs> I know all their secrets because they think I can't tell anybody. Would we be like Bonnie and Clyde then? 
Yeah, I guess you could say that. This sounds like fun. Deal. Deal. Wait, what even is your name? It's Bailey. That's pretty. How are we gonna do this? Don't worry, I already have it figured out. Let's get dressed together to go to a Halloween party. You guys are not ready for the costume that I bought. This is the first piece of the costume. Take your guesses now. I feel like you already know what I'm gonna be. And this is the second piece to my costume. Of course, this is the iconic Wonder Woman corset. I don't know how I'm gonna get this on, but we're gonna figure it out. The way my arms are bent. I believe. I'm so excited. I am out of breath. <laughs> I don't even know how I did that by myself, honestly. Impressive? A little small, but the girls are girling. I'm extra, so of course I had to get the cape too. Ah! <laughs> what do you guys think? This is the best that I've ever looked in my entire life. More accessories, we have the armbands. Absolutely iconic. For the shoes, I'm gonna wear my giant naked wolf boots. And this is my final Halloween costume. I just know I'm gonna have so much fun in this outfit tonight. I'm off to save the world, bye. Dress with me for another Halloween party. Honestly, I don't think anything can top the Wonder Woman costume, but tonight I'm gonna be Pamela Anderson. First piece of this costume is a long black skirt. Once again, I'm gonna have to do this corset up by myself. Some accessories, I have the tall black glove. My thumb is too fat for the hole. Make sure I pull it high enough to cover the pig tattoo. I just rechecked the inspo photo and she's wearing pants. Now I gotta take this shit off. Okay, wait, why does this look so much better? For the shoes, I think these insane Namilla boots would look so fucking good. Actually, it looks kind of stupid, so I'm not gonna do it. Instead, I'm gonna wear my trusty leather Steve Madden boots. Are you ready for the height difference? <laughs> the only accessory she had was a pair of sunglasses. Okay, I feel like this is pretty good. Cute. My friend called my wine glasses a gauntlet the other day and she's not wrong. Guys, I just broke the fucking wine glass. Are you actually kidding me? This is my final Halloween costume for night two. I'm gonna go have fun and be hot. Comment if you like this costume or Wonder Woman better. <clears throat> Headphones or sunglasses? What? I want headphones so I can listen to Olivia Rodrigo on full volume. They won't play any music? What the heck is the point of these stupid things? I hate being your friend and I wish that I never met you. What did you just say to me? Um, all I said was good morning, how are you? I swore you said something else. No, definitely not. I slept with your best friend. You're cheating on me? Baby, what? No, why would you say that? I knew you were a lying little piece of sh- It was only one time. No, we're done. Don't talk to me. Mary, I need you to say something to me. Um, like what? Anything. I really like the shirt you're wearing. Okay, now say it one more time. That shirt is hideous. This is my favorite shirt. What? But I said that I liked it. These headphones let me hear the truth. <gasps> Can you tell me if my boyfriend's cheating on me then? Girl, you literally saw him making out with someone else. But I love him. I smell your shoes while you're in gym. Ew, what is wrong with you? The scent of your feet is great. Hey bitches, get dressed with me to go to the Melrose Trading Post. If you don't live in LA, you're probably like, Bailey, what the fuck is that? It's basically a flea market with like everything you could ever imagine. I really want to wear this Guns N' Roses baby tee. Emphasis on the baby part because I genuinely got this from the kids section at Target. If it fits, it fits. I have been dying to wear this little green mini skirt. I have struggled, but I think I won. It's very short, so I'm gonna have to walk around like this. I don't know why I can never find a matching sock. They're always close, but just not quite right. I definitely need a jacket because I'm always cold and this one is just so fucking cool. This is cute, I can't tell. I think I'm gonna try this little crop jacket from Brandy Melville. I just got these insane platform sneakers from Windsor Smith, so I think I have to wear them. Okay, now that I see it with the shoes, I've changed my mind and I'm gonna put this shirt on. Okay, I feel like this outfit just took a full 180. I took off the locket and put on some different bigger chains. I think that this is our final outfit. I really like it. I've been trying to be a little bit more quirky with my outfits because I always wear the same three pieces of clothing. Let me know what you would rate this out of 10 in the comments. Dude, I got tickets to a rock concert tonight. Wanna come with? I don't know. Rock music isn't really my thing. Ugh, no wonder your innocence is 100%. Wait, I'll come with you. <gasps> Great, but you're not wearing that. My outfit is fine. I like being comfortable. <laughs> you're gonna regret that. Tickets, please. Oh, honey, Disney on Ice is next door. Actually, I'm here for the rock concert. Oh, okay then. Go ahead. You sure you don't want the outfit? Give it to me. You look so cool, and where did you get the boobs? Shut up. Jessica, I didn't know that you were coming. Oh my god, hey guys. Lucky you, we have two extra backstage passes. Do you want them? We'll take them. Come on guys, let's meet the band. Uh, excuse me miss. Hmm? I think that you dropped this. Oh, uh, thank you. Dude, that was the lead singer of the band. What does the paper say? It has a phone number and it says, call me for a good time. Dude, you have to call him. 
No way, that's out of my comfort zone. Ugh, no wonder your score is so high. You're no fun. Come on, let's just go watch the show. Wait, guys. I can't call him because I'm a virgin. What? We can't hear what you're saying. I'm a virgin. Yeah, no shit. We could have guessed that ourselves. You never know. Maybe he doesn't want to hook up with you. He wrote call me for a good time. What else does that mean? Either you call him or I'll do it for you. Fine, I'll call him after the show. Thank you guys so much for the support. Have a great night. Don't look at me like that. I'm gonna call him. Hello? Who is this? Uh, hi, this is the girl from backstage. Oh, good. I was hoping that you would call. Come meet me in my dressing room backstage. Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, hey, come on in. I wanted to talk to you. Hi, what's up? So, have you ever thought about becoming a singer before? I, I mean, I was in chorus, but not really. Our lead singer had a family emergency, and she's going to be gone for three weeks. Hang on a minute. Are you asking me to be in the band? Kinda. I want you to come to our tryouts later this week. Your style's cool. I think you'd make a great addition. Okay, maybe I will. Bro! Oh, were you guys eavesdropping? Yeah, we had to. You are definitely trying out. Guys, I don't even know if I can sing or not. Do you want to get your innocence score lower or not? Guys, I can't sing this song. This has a bad word in it. You're not a toddler. You can swear. You're freaking out about nothing. That was so good. Okay, I guess the worst they can say is no. Okay, this is actually happening. I'm really scared. You practice for this. You're going to be just fine. Next in line for auditions, please. Wish me luck. Happy birthday, sweetheart. Thanks. Can I have a piece of cake now? No, not yet. Aww. But you can't have your gift. Headphones, but I don't even have a phone yet. They're not for your phone. Whatever you do, you cannot take them off. But why? I can't tell you until you're older, okay? Miss, no headphones in class. I already told you, Miss Smith, I am not allowed to take them off. You're such a weird child. Why can't you take them off? Um, I'm not really sure. My mom just said I can't take them off. You've never asked why? Do you just listen to everything your mommy says? Uh, I've never really asked. Well, you should. I'm having a party tonight. You should come. Really? But you can't wear the headphones. Hey. What did I tell you about the headphones? You're not allowed to come inside until you take them off. Okay, fine. I'll do it. Let's see what you're hiding. What? Where did she go? Hello? What do you mean? I'm right here. She vanished. Hello? How is that possible? $100 to me or $100 to someone who needs it. But I could get so many drinks from Starbucks with that money. Ugh, I can't. I'm going to feel guilty. A new Lamborghini for me or a new Lamborghini for somebody who got their car stolen. I can't imagine getting my car stolen. How would you get to the mall? I hope you like your new Lamborghini. I got a G-Wagon, isn't it so cool? You didn't give it to someone in need? No, I need it so that I'll look super hot in the school parking lot. YOLO! No way, you actually just said YOLO. A new house for me or a new house for somebody who lost theirs in a fire. I want a house. Isn't there like insurance to cover that? We have a house. We don't need one. But what if the new one is bigger? Fine, do what you want, but you will not be coming into my mansion. Trust me, I will not come crawling to you. That's what they all say. You lost? Where did my G-Wagon go? Um, mine does not say that. What do I win? Only say four-letter words or only speak Spanish. How would that work? I don't even know how to speak Spanish. Four letters it is. Hey, sis, I'm having my ex over, so don't talk to him. Girl. I know he cheated, but he is so hot. Foul. You can judge me all you want, but I am in love with him. Hey, babe, thanks for having me over. How are you? Good. Uh, okay. Do you care if I go out with the boys tonight? Fine. Are you sure? Are you gaslighting me or something? Nope. Okay, I feel like you're actually mad and just not telling me. Do you have an energy drink? Bang? What? I only banged that girl one time. Exit. Wait, babe. No, no, no. I was just joking. I swear. Door. Fine, I'll go. Honey, did you just break up with him? Oops. He was gonna invite you on a fully paid family trip to Europe. Fuck.